Lesson 100. My part is essential to God's plan for salvation. Hi there. Would you like to know how important your happiness is to God's plan for the salvation of the world? Here's how it goes. Just as God's Son completes His Father, our parts in God's plan for salvation complete His plan. Salvation is the end of the belief in separation. We're not separate thoughts or separate bodies leading separate lives and going separate ways. Our shared function unites our minds in one purpose, for each one of them is equally essential to them all. What God wants for us is perfect happiness. Let's not go against His will. The function He has given us is essential to His plan, as is to our happiness. The joy we feel in fulfilling our function is important to all the people we encounter in our lives. Seeing our joy in our faces, they will understand God's plan and hear God calling them in our happy laughter. My part is essential to God's plan for salvation. We are all essential to God's plan. Without our joy, His joy is incomplete. Without our smiles, the world cannot be saved. When we are sad, God's light in us is dim, and no one laughs because all laughter can but echo ours. My part is essential to God's plan for salvation. We are all essential to God's plan. Our lights increase every light that shines in heaven, and our joy on earth encourages others to let go of their sorrows and join us in God's plan for salvation. The joy of God's messengers heals sorrow and despair. They are the living proof that God wants us to be happy, and so they will be the ones who accept His gifts. Today, let's not be sad. If we do, we won't be fulfilling our part in God's plan and our vision. Sadness is a sign that we are trying to do something else instead of what God has assigned to us. By doing so, we fail to show the world how great the happiness God wants us to have. We won't realize that this happiness is ours. Today, let's try to understand that joy is our function here. If we are sad, our part is not fulfilled and all the world is deprived of joy. God asks us to be happy, so the world can see how much He loves His Son. We are God's messengers today. We bring His happiness to everyone we meet and His peace to everyone who looks at us and sees His message in our happy faces. Let's take our 5 minute per hour exercises to practice feeling happy according to our Father's will. Begin by thinking about the idea of the day. My part is essential to God's plan for salvation. Then realize that your part is to be happy. Only this is asked of you or anyone else who wants to be a messenger of God. Think about what this means. No sacrifice is necessary. Receive only what is part of God's plan and never lose, sacrifice, or die. Try to find the joy that God wants you to have. It is your function to find it here and now. For this you came. Let today be the day you succeed. Look inside yourself and don't worry about the small thoughts and silly goals that you pass as you ascend to meet the Christ in you. He will be there, and you can reach Him now. What would you choose to see instead of the one who waits for you to see Him? What small thought or silly goal can hold you back and keep you from success when the one calling you is God Himself? He will be there. You are essential to His plan. You are His messenger today, and you must find what He would have you give. Let's not forget the idea for today between our hourly practice periods. It is yourself that calls to you today, and it is Him you answer every time you repeat today's idea. My part is essential to God's plan for salvation. What do you think about that? Have you ever come to the realization that true happiness was a significant part of our journey together? You're doing great! See you tomorrow for another incredible lesson. If you enjoyed the video and found it helpful, please don't forget to give it a like and leave a comment. Thanks. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. There's a new lesson every day.